Hey guys, I was going to show you what the Razer Lycosa keyboard looks like um, lit up um, in my macro video um, for the keyboard. So I decided that I'd quickly show you in a separate video um, since it's a lot easier. So um, basically we have these controls at the top here. Um, I'm not sure if you can see them very well. So we basically have um, play and pause, stop. Uh, previous and next track and in the top corner here we have volume down volume up and um, we have um, brightness for the um, keyboard so this is what the keyboard um, more or less looks like um, lit up it looks um, very nice very um, stylish or if you um, click it again it will just light up the WASD keys, which is pretty nice. Um, if you don't want to get blinded by the keyboard, yet you want to, you know, have a general idea of where the keys are, that's pretty handy. So, um, yeah, it looks um, very nice, um, lit up. You know, um, I highly recommend getting this keyboard. Um, and I was also going to show you how to um, disable the Windows key for gaming, you know, like if you're playing WoW or whatever game you play and you accidentally click the Windows key, it's really annoying. So as you can see now, um, the Windows key is obviously working. So if you um, click the, if you just um, put your finger on the icon there, the Razer icon, and hold your finger there, then click the Windows key, this will disable it. So I'm going to click that down, click the Windows key, and now when I click the Windows key, nothing happens. So if I hold down on that key again, on the um, Razer icon again and click the Windows key, it now um, reactivates the Windows key. Um, it's a pretty um, neat feature, um, you know, if you, you know, accidentally um, click it a lot, um, a lot whilst playing games. So yeah, that's pretty much what it um, looks like when it is lit up and um, I will be showing you the macros in an upcoming video, so stay tuned.